Hi, and welcome to our channel. Um, my name is Tracy, and if you're new here, thanks for joining me. And I say our channel because if you're new here, um, what you don't know is that this is a channel with my dog Bandit, with my daughter, um, and myself. So for different content, there is always me. Um, and then sometimes my daughter, if there's snacks involved or if it's one of her crates, she's there. Uh, Bandit pops in and out, so you'll see him behind me probably chewing on something. He's far cuter than me, so he will really distract you, and that's quite all right. Um, so I have a bunch of different boxes today. I thought I'd open them all together because sometimes people do like to see a little compare and contrast. Um, I have some brand new ones. I have some kind of new, like I've only opened once before, and then some standards. And one of them is, I believe, my last box. All right. So I want to start off with one of the brand new ones, and this is by Paradise Delivered. And this is a monthly subscription box, and I believe it's from the same people that do single swag. So I did get one single swag one of these i think i'm just going to take a look and decide which one i want to continue with for a little while what i'm trying to do is try out new things for a little while do a few boxes with it and then maybe just you know keep trying new things until i get some stuff that like i'm just crazy about the single swag was all right i had really ordered it specifically for the book that was in there which is called the positivity kit and it was just so cute inside and i thought my daughter would really appreciate it what with kind of you know she does remote learning so she's stuck at home she doesn't get to see her friends it can get her a little down and I thought she would enjoy it um the stuff in there was nice it wasn't there wasn't anything wrong with it um it just didn't hit the great meter okay so when you open it up you've got your little card and let's see is this the product card this is the product card just like in single swag it does talk about um how to win your next box all right, and then take a little look at the products inside. Here we go. And this also has a book in it. And it has, I'm just going to start off with this candy bar, which is the exact same candy bar that we got in the single swag. It is a Sweet Wishes dark chocolate, premium European chocolate. It is a very dark chocolate. My daughter enjoys the very dark chocolate. Um, I like dark chocolate, but if it's too dark and it's almost bitter instead of sweet, I don't care for it, but she actually prefers that. Um, so it doesn't say on here. Let's see, it's valued at $5. And it doesn't say on the card either um, what the percentage is, but I recall it being quite bitter. All right, so by Trifle Cosmetics is a liquid glow liquid illuminator. And let's see what it says about this. It says, keep that summer glow going all year round with this rich and luscious cream based formula with nutritious kumquat and avocado fruits to keep your skin hydrated and scrumptiously smooth without stick streaking or sticking. And it says to apply to your face, arms, or wherever you need radiance. Um, it's vegan and cruelty-free. This is the little, it's upside down there, the little container. And I'm interested, this is a program I would be interested in. It is valued at $24 for this size, which is how much? Um, look and see. Oh, it comes out this pink, like a rose gold color. I think that just has been the theme for February, has been rose gold. So I'm just going to kind of rub it in. And, oh, that is... So you can't really see on here, but from what I'm seeing, it does give a very nice sheen. There is kind of a rose gold undertone, so I would maybe put this on my cheeks, not necessarily all over, um, because I wouldn't want kind of that pink look everywhere. I already have that from rosacea. I'm not looking to get any more of that. Okay. So next by Canyon Moon is the Jasmine Gardenia Candle. And it's in this nice little tin. 
oh it smells so fresh it smells like I'm definitely picking up the jasmine maybe a little bit of gardenia but it's a really clean not like a perfumey smell so I do like that that is valued at $16 and it does not say let's see does it say on here if it's a soy look. it does not so I'm gonna guess it's not a soy based candle because usually it will say on there if it isn't it doesn't say in the description here either but still a nice candle all right by elizabeth stone oh, looks like this it looks like so when i take it out first of all it's like this and then well i mean it was like this it was definitely on there but then there's a little bag underneath that I'm thinking that this should have been packed in so it's not all tangled. So the necklace gets tangled enough once I put it on. So now I've got to tangle it before I even do that. Um, this is from ElizabethStoneJewelry.com and it says Laid Back Glam. and dreamy bohemian jewelry designed in los angeles okay i'd love to show you what it is but it's a big tangled mess right now there we go we finally got it and that is cute and it is kind of long. It has a nice, um, a nice size extender on there. So it does, it is pretty. It is, um, doesn't seem like the most strongest made. And then I don't know if you can see this. And I don't know if you got the subscription, if you can tell me, it almost looks like this broke and then they just fixed it with some little kind of silver tabby thing. Um, that yeah i'm gonna have to look into this because i think that this item was broken and then just flimsily put back together because that's this moves around so that shouldn't be there unless it's there to keep it from moving all the way around though i don't know why they would do that so if you got the subscription tell let me know if you got this little you can see that this little kind of silver, it just looks like a little piece of wire. Um, and again, it wasn't packaged up in the way a brand new item would be packaged up. So, and they're valuing this at $62. It's 17 inches with a three inch extender. Um, I mean, I don't think that's worth $62. All right, next we have the Way of the Will Brightening Serum. And I feel like I received this before. A lot of people said it was in Causebox, so maybe I got it in Causebox. Um, I think I gave it away as a Christmas gift because I have so much serum. So I have heard it's a very nice serum. A lot of people really enjoy it. Um... It says it's made with marula, black currant, and carrot. And it's a brightening face serum valued at $38, which I know their stuff is a little bit pricey. Okay, next are some Steve Laurent tweezers. Uh, looks like there's two of them valued at $24. They're stainless steel. This is not likely something I will keep. I don't, I don't have thick eyebrows at all or really, there you go. I don't use tweezers very often and I do have plenty of pairs. It looks like one is kind of a regular, a regular flat and the other one's on my floor. Um, on the other one's kind of a pointy and I'll tell you the thing I use these for the most 
this is kind of a pointy. The thing I use these for the most is really getting ticks off dogs because I don't care what I put on them, what kind of tick preventative, you still get ticks. They still climb aboard. Next in here, one is the Do You Calming Lavender Body Spray. And I don't know if you can tell, but it's got sparkles in there. So we already know where this is going, right? So oh, my cap isn't on very tight. I'll tell you what I miss. Oh, it's, it's all right. It's not great. It's not my favorite. I like, I like lavender, but this almost smells more like the alcohol that they're using to diffuse it. Um, it is cruelty free. Um, I miss how Target used to package things when they had their mystery bags or boxes. Um, they weren't mystery because they could see what was in it before you bought it. But they used to put like a tape around it so that it wouldn't come loose in your packaging and then muck everything up. Because there is a book in here. Oh, and this is valued at $16. And I guess it's by We Live Like This. Oh, yeah, it says that right up there. Okay. Um, and so the book is Wildflower by Drew Barrymore. It's valued at $18. And um, it says, shares funny, insightful, and profound stories from her past, present, told from a place of happiness that she currently enjoys. So, um, I mean, it seems like a nice book. Not really what I typically read. I read more like... Um, thrillers, um, a lot of like kind of detective type novel things. Um, so I will gift this, but I know exactly who will like this. So that is earmarked. Although some of these things you may see, well, and this is earmarked for the kid. Um, the tweezers you will likely see in a future giveaway. Again, I'm trying to get to that 100 subscriber. And then when I do that, I already have a box of things put aside. So hit that like, subscribe, and the notification bell so we can get to that 100 subscribers and um, get, a, get a box out to you guys or to somebody. All right, next, this is a new subscription to me. I have gotten it one other month. And um, I saw this unboxed by... Um, another channel sub box lover and I thought oh that's really pretty um the price is right I'll put the prices down below because I don't know what I'm doing these what I've paid for them um I know the paradise paradise whatever paradise delivered box I know I got that from um crate joy and I believe if you got a three or three month or more subscription you got 40% off I don't know if it was 40% off the first box or if it was 40% off the whole thing uh, but if you go on crate jar you'll often find things like that I'm just opening it back up again because yes so I thought so so I thought I had seen this in jo Johanna's um, unboxing when she took it out there was a 20% off coupon um, and it says in the bottom single single wow 20 which is another thing that made me think that they were related to single swag because well, I don't know I thought I said single swag but still it's very similar box so I would say you probably wouldn't need both like I'm probably because I think I got multiple months on this I think I'm going to just cancel the single swag and um finish out this subscription then maybe go back to it I'm not sure um if it's so close to this, I may just do that and be done with it. All right, so this month they said they're celebrating romance and love. So this is the Paris collection. So it always comes in this nice bag. And I've looked at a couple different jewelry subscriptions, but this one, again, the price was right. I think I got it on Box, uh, Box Joy, Crate Joy for a discount. Um, you could get just silver, just gold, just rose gold, or a mixture. So I went with the mixture, like a surprise me. And so these are from Laurel and Rose. So they, it looks like they showcase one designer a month. And this has some earrings, which look a little big for me. So these might get gifted. I, I don't know um, if I could really do that. I don't know if that's really... 
I feel like no. I feel like this would not be me. They're nice earrings, but they're just... Sometimes bigger earrings I can do, but sometimes they're just like, mm, no, I don't think so. So I'll have to think on that, but my initial thought is probably not. All right. And then there is this necklace, and that is really pretty. I do like that. It looks a little short, but maybe with the extender. Let's see. Maybe. I can't quite tell. But it is pretty. And I can always get another extender. Those are easy enough. I actually probably have one or two. Um, because sometimes I'll get a necklace and it will fall right here. And I really want it to fall right here. So... All right. So that is Glamour Jewelry. You get two pieces. Um... I don't think they do rings, which is one of the reasons I chose this over the others, because I have thicker fingers, I guess we'll put it. And I don't wear rings a lot because I wash my hands so much that um, I don't even wear my wedding ring because it gets, the area just gets raw. So, um, so it didn't ask about ring size. So I'm going to think that they don't do rings. I'm going to hope. All right. So this is the Bombay and Cedar box. I believe this is the beauty box and I believe either this is my last one or next month is my last one. Um, it's a nice box, but for $25, I just feel like, uh, between Ipsy and BoxyCharm, I'm kind of covered with that. They do, um, do the kind of vegan cruelty free cosmetics. So I like that and I do tend to like what I get. But on average, I feel like the box has kind of gone downhill from when I first got it. So this month's theme for February 2021 is Glam. And it says Beauty Essentials. Now this has tiny writing, so my glasses are going to have to be on for this. So just, I know there's going to be a glare. Just excuse the glare. And let's see. Now there was, I feel like there was one choice item. Yes. Okay, so here, here is the inside, and it's kind of hard to see, and all you're going to really see is that, and now I'm covered in this. So the first thing, and this was my choice item, you could have chosen between a beauty blender with gold stand or a magnifying mirror. So I went with the beauty blender with the stand, and I don't know why I chose that over the mirror other than, I don't know, let's see... Um, I think I probably didn't know where I would even put the mirror because it's like a suction cup one. So I thought I was like, I don't even know where I put that, but that's kind of cute. All right. Next we have by Loritzi Cosmetics, a shade stick in, uh, Mahalo. And I believe we got to pick the color of this and most of there was two colors there was a warm bronze and a cool bronze the cool bronze was um aloha this is valued at 24 dollars. this is valued either at 15 or 20 i'm not sure because it says 15 to 20 for that choice item and so this i don't know i felt like both shades looked like they would be a little dark for me so this is it but again, I do have kind of a dark shade stick for um, the Trustique, and I use it under my makeup. So that's what it looks like on me going on. But I'm wondering, blend it out. You can kind of, just kind of looks about the same. So I, I think I could probably use that. I mean, I've used it now, so <laughs> it's out of that or the garbage, right? All right, and then by Evolu um, is a brightening toner, and this is valued at $38. It says it's good for all skin types. So I'll just hold that up for you to see so you don't have to see me reading. And it's a powerful brightening formula that reduces the appearance of sun damage, age spots, scars, and discoloration. So, 
All right, this is, I'm not going to try to get in there because I have a lot of boxes, so I want to kind of just touch base on what we got here. All right, two more things in here. One is by Facetory, and it is the Everyday Charcoal Detoxifying Mask. And I guess you would have gotten one of a bunch of different ones. It looks like there's eight different ones. And it the value is anywhere from $2 to $3.50. And obviously the different masks would do different things. Um, so I am excited about that. I love a good face mask. And then the last thing is by Model Rock Cosmetics. And it's called Eye, is that Eye Link? Um, it's the Graffiti Eye Ink. It's the Graffiti Collection eyeliner in squeeze tubes eyeliner in, and this is blackest black so I don't know if there was a variety this is valued at $25 and it says it's a long wear water resistant formula that can also be smudged out to a dark smoky eyeshadow while it dries down to a matte finish and will stay put all day now, I'm not sure how you use a squeeze tube eyeliner. Like, am I? And it's like a chapstick squeeze tube. Like, that just. I'm not. Okay. All right, you know, I'm not going to play with that. I'm going to just put this aside because maybe somebody else knows how to use this. I'm not even going to try to play with it because I, I know why it's just not. So, the value of this box is from 104 to 110. 50. And again, I mean, it's a $25 box. I think, you know, you often do get useful items. I feel like at first when I got it, a lot of the stuff seemed boring, but it was always my favorite stuff. And now it just kind of, I'm kind of at it. Eh, I don't know. I'm not really excited about it at all. All right. Next is ooh, a standard. It's in a different box than usual. It's like in a bigger box. My smart ass and sass, which I love. Drop it like it's hot, but not literally. It's fragile. Maybe it's fragile. Maybe it's not. I don't know what's in there. But I always love this. This is another monthly subscription. This is one that will probably always stay in my rotation because I just find their stuff so funny. And in January, we got this little, you know, the page a day desk calendar, and it always has something funny on there. But usually with a naughty word but I like it and I think it's funny and I laugh at it every day and some of them I even save aside okay so is there a product card in here I don't I don't see one that no I don't see I don't, is it down here okay maybe I opened it up upside down okay so this is the theme and this is February 2021. Today, be the badass you were too lazy to be yesterday. It says on this little card. Let's see what we got. And Oh, and then there's another little saying in here. All right. So we have the first thing on top is this little package here. And it looks like this is a lunch bag by Smart Ass and Sass. So they do make a lot of their own products. Oh, I was going to tell you, they have three levels of subscription. So they have just the t-shirt, just the goods, or the whole thing and so I do get the whole thing it's a little bit more but I love the t-shirts and they're so soft and so this says good food good mood it's not a big lunch bag like I don't know like what's really gonna fit in here but it is you know what I'm gonna do with this is I'm gonna leave it in my car for water or like for beverages because I think this is a nice size for beverages It does have a nice long strap, so that is nice. And it says that it is valued at $20. 
and they do have their own shop so if you see something you like but you don't want to commit to the whole box you can always go online and you can um just grab one of the items they are fairly pricey i found like one time i wanted a bracelet and I had just ordered the subscription, but I hadn't gotten that month. I'd gotten the next month. I was like, oh, I really like that bracelet. And the bracelet alone was like $32. All right. So next is this little stand here. And it says Boss Lady Vibes. Now, is it two sides or one? Sometimes these are two sides. Nope, just the one side. And so I just got one in single swag, which is behind me although you can't see it because it's cut out of the camera but that also says boss lady i think so there's a lot of boss lady around going here now oh, going here going around here this is valued at 15 dollars all right and then we have a water or whatever you want to put in there um jug and this is valued at $20, and this is also by Smart Ass and Sass. It's 16 ounces, and it's perfect for hot or cold temperatures. I do like the little speckling. I'm like in love with little speckled things, particularly the Cadbury mini eggs. Those are my favorite. All right, this is some sleigh spray, it says, by the burlap bag. And let's see. This is also a valuable valuable available as a candle with scents of tropical and citrus fruits okay what do I do with it though do I just oh it's a room spray okay all right so here it is and let's give it a smell you want to sp there's no food no there's no food baby you can't see bandit but he's just like sniffing 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 Ooh, now that does smell nice. I like that. Ooh, it it probably has the fruitier smells, the guava and papaya, because it smells like candy. All right. Next, we have some Bend and Snap hair ties. And these are by Smart Ass and Sass, and they're just cute little hair ties, those kind of soft ones, which is what my daughter and I prefer. Oh. Okay. <coughs> now I would have to say like last month it felt product light this month it feels right right on the on the pulse like it like last month that would have been it we would have been done I feel like there wasn't a lot of products in there this month though there are quite a few and this is like just a little dish I like to put whatever on there That is really cute. And that is valued at $16. And it's by Fringe Studios. And it says rings, earrings, keys, whatever the purpose may be. All right. And then the last thing is that um, dirty hair dust. And it, I've never seen dry shampoo like that. Like it must come out like a powder. Bandit, are you quite all right? All right. So it says dust a little onto your roots. Let it sit for a couple minutes. Then shake your hair with your fingertips and voila. Good to F and go. And this is valued at $5. And really cute packaging. But that's what they were talking about that it doesn't quite cover. All right. And it just like a salt shaker. It's got like, it's all sealed up. So I can't really get in there. And the t-shirt this month. And it doesn't have a cost on that. Although I think if you go on their website, they're like $25, $30 for the t-shirts. And it says Mad Hustle. It's not the funniest one they've had, but it's cute. And it's soft and I usually just wear them around the house or to bed. All right. And then next month's theme is I Can't Even. Oh, my daughter's going to like that. That is her favorite thing to tell me all the time. Oh, mom, I can't even. So she is going to find that very funny. All right. So we have one more subscription and this is brand new and it is pricey. So it has two versions. It's from 
I got it on Crate Joy. That's where I found it. It has the mini version and the full version. It is every other month. So when you break it down, it's not as bad as it seems, but it seems painful when you first kind of look at the cost. So the full size box, which was what I got, because I said, well, I just got it on a month to month. It's every other month, but basis. So I just bought one box and I can always cancel it um, or go down to the smaller box. The one big box is 109 um, And again, if you broke that down, that would be about $55. So that puts it in like kind of the cause box, the FabFitFun kind of arena. So let's see if it measures up. There was a mini box, which was, I believe it was about $60 every other month. And that one, of course, would break down to $30. So, um, so let's see what we got. And again, it is, it is a, you know, a nice size box. It is called the sure thing. Did I say that? I don't know if I told you that. Anyway, it's called the sure thing and or sure thing spelled S H O R E. So it is a beachy themed and we know I love my beachy themed stuff. I guess at this price per month, if you put it as per month, um, it would be like right with Oceanista and, um, Beachley. There is another box inside. So it's a box within a box. Okay, so I think the box was molded around it because it just took me a full, I don't know how many minutes to get that out. But the Sure to Your Door, Sure Thing subscription box, home, beauty, accessories, and life. So then here is the next box. And as I said, from a, and I probably cut that part out, but from a waste perspective, that seems like an awful lot, to, you know, to send it in a box within a box. And I don't mind when I get bubble wrap because I reuse that. So, whoa. Okay, I'm already delighted and I've only opened the box. So, there is this gorgeous throw from Petalstone Cottage Charm. So... This is a nice size throw. It's in like a, a blue green kind of color. I don't know if that's considered aqua. I don't know. My daughter always tells me I have it wrong. It is 50 by 70. And just, I love that. I love the um, patterning in there. We are a bit of suckers from, um, For, for throw blankets. Okay, I just got confused. All right, so it says the box won't always be this tight to get out. It's all because of one item. Okay, so that makes sense. I'm glad they wrote that. That's like a handwritten note though. Like that's not a photocopied. Like they probably had to write this out on every single one. All right, there's a little paper in here that tells you about the items. This is the January, February box. So this throw is valued at $38. And it's a cozy fleece throw, super soft, not too heavy, not too tight. Okay, so next is this little box, which sounds like jewelry. And this is made in Rockport, Massachusetts. And it is, and it is gorgeous. And okay, now this is the kind of jewelry I like to get. So here is the necklace. Now, this looks like the kind of thing I would go into the jewelry store and I would look at it and I would say, oh, that's gorgeous, but there's, you know, I can't afford that. That is way too nice. I'm just trying to even it out. Okay, so there you go. I love the colors. I love those stones. This is definitely going on me. And there are some matching earrings that are just my size. Nice little danglies. All right, and let's see, how big is the necklace? So here is the necklace, but it does have this extender on here. So I think that'll be a good size. I think that'll be a perfect size. This is, oh, it says designed in New York, but it says Rockport, Mass. Um, but it definitely says necklace set, lead and nickel free. 
it's valued at $40. It's a fun costume piece, perfect for any time of the year. All right, so there is the box it came in. So, hmm, okay. Oh, look, I got a little handwritten note. Oh my goodness, I gotta open this up next. There's a little card. And it says, hi, Tracy, welcome to your first Chore Thing box. We hope you will enjoy. And then there's a little smile on face. Our special gift to you each month will be a coastal ornament, which will form into a collection as you receive each box. Enjoy your goodies, Jennifer. And then on the back, it says, we love and appreciate reviews on Crate Joy. And Jennifer, you are going to get the best review, not just for this. I mean, I just think the handwritten note is so nice. I also get one from another subscription I got from Crate Joy, which I do need to go on and review because I keep forgetting, but that's the Nail Shack one. And that lady picks out four nail wraps for you. They're always gorgeous. I love nail wraps, as you can tell, because I am not that kind of artist and it is time for me to change them. These are not from her, but um, I have had some really cute ones from her. These are Color Street. Okay, so there is a Godiva chocolate, milk chocolate bar with caramel in it. And I don't, know, I don't think that's listed on here, but it's just a cute little thing. And then there's, oh, there's a little lint chocolate. And I will be hiding that from my kid. This is, oh no, I will give it to her because it's coconut. And coconut's not my favorite flavor. All right, and then there's this little shell in there. And these are all kind of extra things that I don't see listed on here, but we love shells. My daughter's room was all ocean themed. Now it's ocean and Paris themed, so. Okay, so next by Ur Urban is a Shea Butter Enriched Soap. It says salt and sand. Mmm, it smells so nice. And these are valued at $10. And they have Shea and Coconut Butter in them. Here is a Rockport Candle Company, inspired by the sea candle, number 43, Salty Sea Breeze. Mmm, that smells, it smells fresh and clean, not perfumey. And this is valued at, I just saw that, $18, seagrass, white musk, and vetiver. Vetiver? Is that how you pronounce it? I don't know. I don't know. That's how I'm going to pronounce it. All right. Next, we have a face mask, and it is so pretty. And it says if we have to wear masks, they might as well be cute, right? This is 100% cotton. It's double layered. And this is by the Salty Sea Gypsy. And that is so pretty. I do like that. But I never know, like, which way. Is that up? Is that up? I never know. I'm probably going to wear it like this. That could be wrong, though. That's how I'm going to wear it. All right. There is... This little item here wrapped up. This must be that ornament they spoke of. And oh, it is. So it's a sand dollar and it's got like some glitter on it. So pretty. Here's the back. So I don't think it's a real sand dollar. Like I think it's one that they made like a they made it, but that, that was handmade. All right. Next, we have, what is this? It's a little bowl. A handmade pottery by ANJL Ceramics, valued at $35. And look at that. And I bet you every single person's is just a little bit different. So pretty. That would be really nice in a candle inside. Because you've got those little holes. And then there is by Urban a bamboo hair wrap. And this is one of those spa ones. And this is valued at $21. And it absorbs water quickly and dries your hair quickly. So this is, I'm going to guess, one of those ones that you... Oh my god, this is so nice. So nice and soft. So here we go. So I have a couple of the microfiber ones. I have a pink one and a blue one. So I either walk around looking like a demented Smurf 
or a pink marshmallow. Bandit. The neighbor's dogs are barking, so Bandit's going to bark. All right, and there's one last thing in here. And that is this scarf. And look at how gorgeous that is. Oh, my goodness. It's quite big, too. So it's a nice size scarf. It's real pretty. I really like it. Okay, I'm totally sold. I don't think I can cancel this. I think I'm going to have to cancel the single swag and the Paradise Delivered because this is like 9,000 times better. In my opinion. Maybe not in yours, just in my opinion. That's all I can give you. This is the Starfish Scarf and it's valued at $24. So I'll have to add up and see what the total value of the box is, but it's definitely over the $109 that I paid, which is some beautiful items. And I got to tell you, like that necklace set is so gorgeous. And I had definitely seen things like that, maybe because they're made of sterling silver, but I don't know. I feel like I've even seen costumes, like, hello. So this whole set is valued at $40, okay? Whole set. This one little necklace, where is it? It's in the Paradise Deliver box, but that one little necklace at the beginning was valued at $62. I don't think so. Not in my book. I would definitely... See, that one necklace is like maybe a $15 item, and this I would see as maybe a $60 item, but that's just me. Plus, I think that one's broken, too, so I think they gave me a broken item. All right, so anyway, that's what I have for today. It's an awful lot. I think I got through everything I did. I know this is going to be a long video, um, and probably in the future I'll break them down, but there were just like uh, some new things, so I wanted to kind of just get them out there. All right. Thanks so much for tuning in. Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and the notification bell. Um, if you want to, you don't have to. Um, all right. So thanks so much again, and hopefully we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.